uh, do we all know John Hegley? Do we know poet John Hegley? Yeah. I'm a very big fan of John Hegley, and I, I went to see him earlier on in the year, and I met him, and we had a good chat, you know, we had a good rapport going, and then, um, you know, he said afterwards, oh, come on, send me some of your poems, Dad, send me some of your poems. He's like, oh, great, this is it. I sent him some of my poems, and, and all my poetry dreams then will be fulfilled. Um, well, it's been eight months now, and, and I've still not heard anything from John, so uh, I've wrote him a new letter. So, dear John Letter. <laughs> I bought your CD and I bought your book. Bought tickets to your tour, the whole lot. Even ones in Swindon. I bought your t-shirt and your cartoon face stationery. But you still haven't written back to me, John Hegley. I recorded all your TV performances and all your YouTube clips. Made a collage of your face from pasta shells and orange pips. I rewrote all your poems in braille so I could feel them too. But you still haven't written back to me, John Hedley. I started to dress like you, started to walk like you, added a looting accent just to talk like you. Replaced all the mirrors in my house with just pictures of you. But you still haven't written back to me, John Hedley. I wrote a dissertation on you and your impact on poetical verse in the 21st century and explored your allegorical use of logs and dogs as symbols of freedom in a fraught postmodern existence. <laughs> you got a two-two. <laughs> I wrote, directed, produced and played the lead role in Just John, a film biopic of your life and performed it in my bedroom night after night after night. But you still haven't written back to me. John Hegley. I feel like the Eminem song, John, because his name is Stan too. But I haven't got a pregnant Dido in my boot. And you're not a rapper, you're a poet. There's a difference. Not even a postcard, John. Not even a text message, John. Not even a friendship acceptance on Facebook, John. Not even a, oh, how you doing? Yeah. Do you want to come round next Wednesday for dinner? We're having fajitas. Yeah, that'd be lovely, John. <laughs> so I stole your identity, John. Wrote checks out in your name, John. <laughs> Made a modest living from your modest name, John. And I stole your dog, the one with the glasses, and your log. And if you want them back, you can write to me at Stan Skinny, 322 Pinstone Road Street, Sheffield, S54XY. Love Stan. Thank you. Thank you. Good up to Stan, please.